What is going on guys DBG here and this is gonna be the last of the like high tier card gameplays in NBA 2k21 my team today So anyway Before we get on to if you guys are new to the channel subscribe. We are about 230 or so subs off hitting 233k and We're trying to hit that by the end of tomorrow also, lads, you guys could leave a like. It'd be greatly, greatly appreciated. But anyway, PG13, Paul George, six foot nine. He's two twenty pounds. So what we found out about the Curry slide is that if you are six foot nine or taller, and you weigh more than two twenty pounds, you cannot Curry slide. If you are six nine or smaller, you can weigh, you can Curry slide at any weight. If you are six foot nine or taller, you have to be two twenty pounds or less. If you're 220, if you're 221 pounds, you can't curry slide. If you're 220, you're fine. It's why Magic Johnson can curry slide as well. He is 220 exactly. So it is 220 pounds. Um, shout out to Kenny Mack, the owner of 2KMDB, for letting me know that. Just a heads up, because I definitely have given out wrong information about the power forwards, uh, small forward situation. So um, badges, 29 hops, catch and shoot, difficult shots, acrobat, relentless finisher, pick dodger, chase in artist clamps, power crusher, intimidator. He's got contact finisher, fancy footwork, quick first step, dead eye flexible, range extender. He has 27 gold badges, including gold stop and go and gold pump fake maestro. He has got 95 three ball or mid range 94 three ball, good post fade away. He's got 97 driving dunk. He's also got 80, sorry, 94 ball handle, 90 steel, 96 perimeter defense, 94 speed, 91 speed ball, 94 acceleration, and 97 lateral quickness, which are all really, really good. So. Basically, he has got a lot of incredible, incredible stats, obviously. Let's have a look at what he's actually going for. I'm still a bit... I'm still a bit iffy on there being two pantheons. He's about 300k. I think that's probably around fair, fair market value for him. So he's way better, for example, than this Michael Jordan. He's only 150. I mean, let's see what Zion is, actually, because I don't think he's that much worse than Zion. I really don't. And if anything, I think he might be better than Zion. Not Quantum. Oh, I'm in Struggle Town right now. And he's better than Pantheon Zion. He's 600k. So, I reckon he's probably better than Pantheon Zion. And he's probably not as good as Pantheon M. Um, or as Hero Zion. I reckon he's as good as Pantheon MJ as well. Um, Paul George. And the card's got everything. He's got absolutely everything. Like, obviously... He's currying. Kind of OP move. More so on current gen than next gen. Because next gen, they literally just stand on your side. You know what? I might just try. I might just try playing meter off for this video. I'm so not used to meter off that I've got no idea. I'm literally trying to... Uh, I'm going like 2k20 style on it when I used to play meter off. Trying to like get used to this. Ooh. Chicken man. Going back to what we're doing on uh, next gen right here. With our no meter. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This guy is chicken man right here. But um, yeah. So. Spin dunks and stuff. He's going to be fine. Um, They're not as OP on this gen anyway. And just dunking in general. It's PG is going to be great. He's obviously got great length. He's 6 foot 9. Um, going to the basket. He's going to be quite good. Dunking really really good. Even though, yeah, he's pretty decent at power forward, I definitely would run him a small forward. Does he walk with the ball as well? Why is he walking? Why does he walk up the floor like? Oh, sure, it is what it is. He's fine. Oh, yeah. He's, uh... He is definitely, definitely a card that I'm looking forward to using. I think he's gonna be... I don't think I'm gonna buy him because, again, it's the first... Like, he's expensive for what he is now. I'll probably buy him later on in the year. Or I'll probably buy, uh, like, Paul George a similar card. Because I think, if I'm not mistaken, around this time last year, well, it was, like, last week last year, the um, Leap Gear Paul George was out. And that card was, like, similar, similar, like, 200k, and then he went down to, like, 30, 40k quite quickly. But, yeah, I think Paul George... I prefer his release to Kobe base on current gen. I think on next gen, um, Zion might be a little bit better. I reckon Zion is probably like he's just he's just another Wes Unseld. He's just lefty Wes Unseld on next gen. Um, but I do think PG on current gen definitely has the advantage. So anyway, now it's ground three. And 
Come on. Really shooting side of the now? Now let's get on to the game. Me, me, me attempting to play on... Um, what you call it's gonna be gonna be very very uh, interesting play no meter because I have not played no meter in a long 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 time so in comes Paul George where is PG small for power forward so PG oh, I'm playing point guard and he's 6'9 so we got a risky out like Dirk and Jokic yeah that, that lineup works that lineup works because, I mean, worst case scenario means I can just start post with Paul George. post in, like, the 70s, which is... Actually, I can't. I just realized it's stick aiming. I don't have meter on, so I can't just stick aim a bunch of post hooks. So my backup strategy is not... Un is unfortunately not going to be able to work. Okay, let's see, um... Let's see who we are playing against right here. I don't reckon it's going to be anyone great, to be honest. Um, I've come up with kind of weak teams all day. And it seems like most people are grinding limited or, um, yeah, dude locked in Dave Cowens. Wow. Like he's using T-Mac means he probably locked in Dave Cowens recently. But Paul George's matchup with Jeremy Lin, who is streets ahead as his best player. So that's not going to be an easy matchup. That is not going to be an easy matchup at all. Lin's got the half clamps. He's really, he's already on our back. Grabbed. No, we don't have him grabbed, but we hit the midi. All right, let's push up. The way back. Good defense. We stand. Wait, what? Why is Ewing in the game? Did I... I did I put in Ewing? I could have swore I put in Jokic. Either way, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. It's all about... Ewing sets big screens. So I'm fine with it. Come on, can we connect? Oh, okay, that's too deep. That's an X-Gen shot. All right, it's weird not seeing meter on in this gen. It really is. Oh! Obsidian posterizing you in there. We got by him to the basket. PG, nice dunk right there. I thought T-Mac was going to get a block there. We're there. It's a steal. Ah, oh, I thought we were there. He's going to jam it. No. PG gets a moderate contest right there. That's good. How is he trying to defend me? Okay, we should be all right, actually. Honestly, the way he's playing me, I should be able to just burst into space. L2 jump. No. That's a 60. I'm expecting a meter to pop up on every shot. I think I might have to turn it on. Way off. Big board, Paul George. Pro 5 him. And that is a big miss right there. There we go. We finally agree with meter off of Paul George. Good shot. Snatch back, please. Ah, I thought we had that one. Normally, you're in a decent enough position to uh, to guard off, guard a snatch back from there, but I obviously wasn't. Okay, just clamp him. Oh, yeah. He's not going by Paul George. He's not going by Paul George. Let's just clamp him. Let's just clamp him. Oh, that's a steal. He read it to perfection. He's not going by PG. I can unball you. You're still not going by me. And he shot, shoots the very early. Dirk comes out with the board. Hits PG. And it's a slow stop. It doesn't matter. It's still green for Paul George right there. At this stage, again, I should probably just start L2 quick stop. And it's just going to be quicker. Bad defense. And that's probably... That's fake green. That's unfortunate. We unfortunately did not get into the lane. I just boost the way I want to boost. Burst the way I want to burst. To. There we go. That's a good shot. That's just a bad miss. Oh yeah. One dribble. And that is a... Really? He missed that? I don't even care that I turned the ball over. I really missed both of them. Meter on really is a wave on current gen. Meter on really is the wave. I don't care what anyone says. Meter on's the wave. Okay. I can guarantee you I, I smacked my next white. I can guarantee you. I can guarantee you the next white I shoot goes in. 
Maybe not. We, we just add air green and then. We add air green. Deny. Unlucky. Is he going to snatch back? We're so late on that. That was a slidey and not a, an early. That's a terrible shot. And by make my next white, I didn't mean make shoot a heavy. Because yeah, shooting a heavy's not going to go well, I don't think. All right, let's go. We're open. PG. And that is quite a contest as well. And Patrick Ewing, the absolute bomb that is Patrick Ewing, decides he doesn't want to go get the rebound. Oh, Paul George, I'm lucky. And nothing I can do there. Good pinch. Nothing I can do. Absolutely nothing I can do in a lot of these situations. And he misses the white. Okay, 2K, come on. Let me, hit, let me hit a white here. Let me hit a white. Or just let me green. I told you. Next white open white, I'm going to shoot meter off. Is going in. That's a great contest there. It's a great contest. Paul George at run. Trying to back out. Oh, we just spun. We just spun. That could have been a bump steal, but it worked to worked perfection. No defense ready. That's my fault though. He did a good job of launching to Lynn. He's gonna jump. Is he? Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh, we got him. Oh, we completely, completely bamboozled him right there with that explosive. The explosive into the curry. He tried to onball that and we sent him. That's not even an anchor breaker. We just sent him to the other side of the floor right there. All right, we're eyes on now. We're eyes on. Pass the screen away. Oh. Oh, he's just jumping. He's just jumping now at this stage. He's just jumping. He can't guard Paul George. He cannot guard Paul George at all right there. <laughs> Let's go. Paul George, he's good enough that it makes me look like I can do something on offense. He is good enough in game that he actually makes me look like I'm competent at creating my own shot. That is how good PG is. Now, when I use Paul George, I actually look like I'm a moderately good 2k player like he can dunk he can three hunt he can do everything man he can do everything he's defensively as well paul george is insanely good it's just so funny i don't know who's better paul george or magic who i would say is the bet the like paul george versus zion i think i'm gonna go with paul george i have that being said i haven't used the hero zion I have not used the hero Zion, but I'm saying Paul George is way is not way better. He's not definitely not way better. He's better than the possessed Zion. He is definitely better than the possessed Zion. Possessed Zion's really good. It's not by a significant amount by any means. Um and possessed Zion's fantastic. But Paul George is better. Like when we're talking about the elite, Paul George might be better than Jordan. He's better than Jordan. Like, is that a crazy thing to say? Like, I'm, I'm never going to get Paul George. Like, I'm never going to get this PG card. But I reckon later on in the year, I reckon when we start to get, like, all of our Dark Matter cards, when 10, 10 plus Dark Matter cards come out in the next five or six weeks, when we're seeing people playing, playing competitive my team, you're going to see Paul George in more squads, I reckon. You're going to see more Paul Georges than you're going to see Zion Williamson's or Michael Jordan's. I'm almost certain of that. And then we're talking about today, Magic Johnson's the cheese ball. Um... But yeah, I think Paul George might be the best card that came out. He, I think he is. I'm saying it right now. He's the best card that came out today. I think his release is better than MJ and his length is better than MJ. I th also think that his um, just overall three, being three inches taller than both of them puts him that little bit ahead. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you again to It's Mario for letting me use his account. PG and Absolute Beast Lights. So anyway, that's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.